Who's ready for some Disney magic? I am. Let's get into this Swan Resort. Let's check it out. Let's get a full tour, room tour, check out what they have to offer, and have some fun. Welcome to the beautiful, the stunning, the amazing, the tremendous Swan Resort, located in Disney, managed by Marriott. Now, it is considered part of the Disney collection, so you do reap those benefits on top of the Marriott benefits. So really cool. Now this place, the location is amazing because you're right off the boardwalk. You can walk to the boardwalk straight from here. You can jump on the water taxi and take it right over to Epcot, which is within walking distance as well. And what else is great about it? is once you get to Epcot, the Skyliner's right there. So you can travel from park to park and resort to resort right from the Skyliner. Now, they also offer bus transportation to the parks so you can get to where you need to get to every day of staying at this resort. Now, the Swan is located directly across the walkway from the Dolphin Resort so you can enjoy the amenities from both. When I talk about restaurants, well, there's a handful at the Dolphin. One of the most famous is Shalula's Steakhouse. Everybody loves it, it's over there. You can walk across the way and have yourself a fantastic dinner. But we also have some pretty awesome restaurants over here. So you have options over here in this resort too as well. And we're gonna check them all out so you can decide what you want to do do you want to eat here across the way at disney so you can make some really great decisions but the food options here are amazing so let's check it out Hey you watching our video, we appreciate you. Thank you so much. While you're at it, give us a big thumbs up. Let us know how we're doing in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. The dining options are amazing. Now, who's ready for a room tour? Now these are typical Disney slash Marriott rooms. So you can tell you're in a combination of both, right? It's a little bigger than a normal room, which tells me that I'm not in the typical Disney room. And then also um, it shouts out a few different amenities that are very similar from both brands. When you think about the bedding, uh, the toiletries, things like that. One of the things that I disliked about this room was the lack of Disney coffee and Disney soap and shampoo. I love it. Um, but what I did love is that it is a little bit of a larger room. They had foam pillows and feather pillows and just, it was just a very comfortable room. Just absolutely loved it. Let's check it out. Have you stayed here before in the Swan or the Dolphin? If so, tell us about it. Let us know your experience. What did you love about it? What are some opportunities that you saw? I'm holding on, if almost gone. Someday I know I finally make it. Through the gates, 
just have to wait you whisper to me there's no maybe there's only time for dreams even greater i hear the call and i close my eyes to see even clearer i see it all now to my favorite part about this resort I absolutely love the fact that the water taxis are here. You could take a water taxi right into Epcot, which we did. And not only was it a short ride when we got there, I noticed the Skyliner. And that made me really excited because I love the Skyliner. I love the connectivity that Disney has with the Skyliner to get into different parks and explore other resorts too as well. Because you can shop and eat at those other resorts you can enjoy their amenities too as well so really cool definitely my favorite part now let's talk about my second favorite part the boardwalk it's right here it's basically on property you walk i don't know a fifth of a mile and there you are. You can see the hotel in the background there. But a uh, lot going on in the evening. Not so much during the daytime. But there is a great Disney store here. And other dining and shopping options. Which is awesome. Well, we've come to the end of the video. But it's really not the end. Book a trip. Get to Orlando. Get to the Swan Resort. And have a blast. It's about a 10 minute walk to Swan and Dolphin versus a long way for the boat if you didn't want to wait in line tonight. You're more than welcome to take advantage of that. But the boats will be here until 10. So do with that information what you will. As we dock here at Epcot, please remain seated. If you stand, I'll run up the handrails and seat backs around you. 